Manchester United were dealt a blow on Thursday when Anthony was taken off on a stretcher against Chelsea inside half an hour with an injury described as serious by Eric Ten Hag. The winger looked in discomfort following a tackle from Treva Chalabaugh and now is considered a big doubt for the FA Cup final against Manchester City in eight days' time. Anthony has been a prominent part of Ten Hag's plan this season. The Brazilian has played 44 times, 39 of those being starts, and has recorded 8 goals and 3 assists. His potential absence would be a huge miss for United, although there are several players who can step into the gap left on the right flank. Behind the front three, the midfield trio and back line might well select itself. David De Gea will undoubtedly start with Aaron Juan Basaka and Luke Shaw as the full backs. Victor Lindelof will likely partner Rafael Varane at centre half with Lissandro Martinez out for the season while Casemiro, Christian Eriksen and Bruno Fernandes are back to start in front of them. What the front three will look like amid Antony's absence is not certain, although one possibility seems the most plausible. Rashford Marshall Sancho Marcus Rashford became the first United player since Robin Van Persie 10 years ago to score 30 goals in a season after finding the net against Chelsea. To start him anywhere else but the left would be criminal, especially after being so ineffective as the lone striker in October's 6-3 defeat to City. Marshall is one away from hitting double figures this term and is United's best centre forward by a distance. Ten Hag has trusted in Sancho despite a period of stagnant form in recent weeks. Not only is he likely his preferred backup to Antony, Sancho has played much more fluidly when on the right. He has two goals and an assist from 10 games in the position this season. A better output than his three goals and two assists in 19 games on the left. Garnacho Rashford Sancho A lot of fans are not satisfied with Marshall's overall contributions this season when not injured, and so wouldn't be too disheartened not to see him in the lineup. Alejandro Garnacho is the popular choice. He would be deserving of a start in the final, and he has shown in his character that he would not get overawed by the occasion. If he does come in, then Rashford would likely be the one leading the line. This is most likely the front 3-10 Hag will finish with given Marshall as yet to see out a whole 90 minutes this season, but of course there is the possibility he fields it from the start. Garnacho Marshall Rashford A third scenario sees Marshall retain his place and begin Rashford on the right. Ten Hag seems to have learned his lesson by playing Fernandez on the flank and would be taking a risk if he did so against this City team. Rashford's ratio from the right isn't too bad. Two goals from four appearances, all of them starts. Garnacho seems to be played almost exclusively on left wing having only played on the right ones 19 minutes in the 1-0 loss to Real Sociedad. So if the teenager does start then it will be on the left and Rashford will be swapping flanks if Marshall remains in the side.